Hello and welcome to Tiny Code Christmas Extra, Day 4. These extra challenges are designed for people who've already completed Tiny Code Christmas, so they may introduce concepts that haven't been covered in the main Tiny Code Christmas exercises. So this is what we're going to be working with today. This is a rotating full screen effect where the center of rotation is moving. And if we take a look at the code, we can see obviously we're visiting every pixel on the screen. We're changing the center of the rotation. We are then rotating around the angle T, which we're using the time to provide us with. And then we are plotting that based on the rotated coordinates in an AND pattern. And again, I've just divided that by five to make the to make the pattern a bit a bit nicer. And we also have the same over here for Pico 8. And again, the main difference with Pico 8 being the rendering. So again, we have time given us our angle. We are instead using a for loop to generate random X and Y points. And we're changing the center of rotation. We're rotating around the angle. And then we are plotting that based on the angle. And I've just made the coordinates here the color just divided that by 10 so that the pattern is a bit bigger and easier to see. So today's challenge is to get this code as small as possible while keeping the point of rotation moving. It doesn't have to be moving in this exact pattern but there has to be some motion around where the rotation takes place. Best of luck.